Okay, median mode and mid range. Okay, median here. Median stands for the middle number in a data array. Okay, yeah. A data array is a ordered list. So you have to take all of your numbers, put them in order, and then find the middle one. Mode here is the one that occurs most often. Mid-range is adding your range and dividing by two. So it's your low plus your high divided by two. So it actually has a formula that goes with it. So those are the three we'll talk about in this video. Um, so here's a set of data. Doesn't quite fit. I'll sneak it over here so it fits. So we got one, seven, three, two, four, eight, five. Well, first off, you got to make it an array by ordering it. So I'm going to go one, two, three, four, seven, and eight. I do believe is correct. And I think there should be seven numbers there. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oop, I'm missing a number. So we got uh, one, two, three, four. Oh, I'm missing the five. So I'll stick that in there. So five, seven, and eight. And you're going to do the same thing. So uh, make sure you double check everything. And so the median then, since there's seven numbers, I'm going to count in three. So one, two, three. And I'm going to count backwards three. One, two, three. And notice I didn't count the four in the middle. And so that is your median. So median is, and we use capital MD for median. For another, another uh, way to do this is to list them on a slip of paper and then fold the paper in half. And your median is represented where the crease is at. So that's kind of a neat way to look for median as well. Um, so there's median. Mode. In our case, this is kind of nice, <laughs> there is no mode. Nothing occurs, everything occurs the same number of time. Everything occurs one time, so the mode is none. Be careful that you don't use the word zero. Um, zero would mean that there's a number. And then the final thing we, I said I'd show you how to do is mid-range, which is very easy. It's 8 plus 1 divided by 2, so that's 9 divided by 2, or 4.5. So there's your mid-range mode and median. So here's another set of data. Can't fit it all on the screen, so I'll just kind of pan back and forth. We got 209 on up to 240, and there's 10 numbers. So it's already listed as an array. Everything's in the right order. And there's 10 of them, so we're going to count in five. So one, two, three, four, five, and we end at 213. Then we go to the back half of the data and count in. One, two, three, four, five. And we notice we end and there's no number in the middle. So we've got to come up with a number. Uh, what number is that? And how you do that, uh, pretty easy, is you add them and divide by 2. So 213 plus 223, all divided by 2. And uh, let's double check that. So 213 plus 223 divided by 2 is 218. And there's my median. Mode's kind of interesting here because I noticed just staring up here at the screen, I've got two 240s. And if you go back here, we've got two 211s. Everything else in that whole uh, array is listed one time. So our mode, this is a bimodal system here. We've got 211 and 240 for our modes. And then the last one, 209 and 240 are our low and our high. So our mid-range is 209 plus 240, all divided by 2. 209 plus 240 divided by 2 is 224.5. And so there's our mode, median, and mid-range. So hope this helps. Good luck, and see you next time.